What's up guys, Mike Zard here, and today I have Battle of the Week versus Dundies. We were nominated, and I have to fight him in a best of three, and I'll probably post this to the thread. Uh, sorry in advance that there's something wrong with the sound, so I sound really quiet, and it's, I don't know. I'm trying to fix it in editing, but I, I'm not sure what the sound issue is. Um, but yeah, Battle of the Week. So I'm going to challenge Dundies with my choo choo train and we're gonna we're gonna see how that goes uh, he also has this custom avatar at last wait is he playing a game no okay <laughs> he thought he thought kaboom was me so I just, I just scouted his team a bit i'm not gonna change because that would just be rude that would just be rude i'm gonna send him some more alerts because he, he ain't responding? Okay. Okay, we just gotta... I just need to change my copy-paste, and... So we both decided to bring Raichu teams, which is kind of interesting, but... I don't get why Raichu on that team, because, like, you know, he's got a special sweeper thing, he's got, I mean, one of these is gonna be Scarfers, the other one's gonna be a Life Orb Breaker, that's just a lot of special spam. Uh, my team is built around Raichu, and then going into Blimp, and win I forgot to, uh, quit out of Discord, I don't wanna spam Discord alerts, alerts. Um, so, my own Raichu puts in a lot of work versus his team, even though I decide not to run Focus Blast, for whatever reason. Um, Drift Blim is also just good. If I can knock off the Vullaby or like weaken it with Grumpig, even though I'm T Wave, not Taunt, that's really unfortunate because Taunt and Focus Blast could weaken that for Blimp. I do have Sucker on Blimp just to fuck with shit. And, um, yeah. So, leads. I think he's gonna lead, uh, maybe Gabite would seem perfectly reasonable. Maybe even his own Raichu. I am, uh,. I'm just gonna lead with my Raichu. Is he actually just straight up throws out his Reg Ice, which is rather annoying because right now he has no reason not to click Ice Beam, and uh, that'll do a good amount of chip on my Grumpig, which I really don't want to take, but I don't have a choice. Uh, that does 20. Okay, I expected that to do more. I won't. I'm not even gonna lie. I thought that would do more damage, and it didn't. Uh, right now, his Volibee is an incredibly predictable switch in. Uh, but I'm still gonna catch that with the T wave. Okay, he, I, I thought, I thought he would make some sort of double or prediction, but he does go right to Volibee. He's no reason not to U-turn, but I'll still go to Bite. I actually get a full para, which is very nice. Um, looking back on it though, T wave wasn't really safe because I did want Volibee to get toxic. That was ideal because I want it weakened for Drift Blim, and I didn't do that, and that's annoying. So I'm gonna get a Brock. See what he wants to do. Is he goes directly into Raichu? Uh, I mean, he's clicking HP Ice. I could go right to Simi Sage just because I don't need it healthy. Um, I don't want to go Grumpig and get that chipped. I need to preserve that for his Red Ice. I could go right to my Raichu as well. Because, uh, I'm going to go Simi Sage. As he actually just straight up clicks Thunderbolt and still does a fuck ton of damage. Um. That is actually scary, because if I click Seed Bomb, I'm gonna knock off. Well, he might just stay in, take the hit, take out Semi Sage. I but I would think he would want to go to one of his three Violet users. I don't know. I'm gonna double right you. That's safe play. As uh, he he goes Volibi, which is amazing. Because uh, right now I have rocks up, and if he wants to go to Reg Ice, I can ship that. But if he wants to go to his own Raichu from Lightning Rod, that would be threatening. Um, I'm just gonna HP Ice. As he does go to his own Raichu, so that's good. Uh, unfortunately, not gonna. Okay, so Surf will KO him after Life Orb damage, which I think is just what I want to do. Ah, I win the Speed Tie as well. Catch him with the Surf. Alright. Surf Raichu is just, a, it, like, it's a mon that people have been recently realizing. Like, we left it high ranked, and now it's just not as good anymore. Um, but it's sort of been picking up. Uh, he goes Metang, he's gonna get rocks. I don't want to defog those away, because 
my own rocks are more useful at chipping things. Like, his Volibi is going to be a 50%. That's amazing. Uh, I could go right to Driftblim and just click Knock Off. That would be a fair play. Or I could go right to Gabite, but Gabite invites in Volibi, which I don't necessarily like. I think I'm going to go right to Blimp, because he's either going to Earthquake or go for Rocks. Or he Pursuits. That is a fair play. That is a fair play. I can't judge that play. I didn't really think of that, uh, which I should have, but this is just a free knockoff here. As he does go Volibi, he's taking damage, he's knocked off, he's weakened, and I can go right back to Raichu. As he defogs. Um, now he really should go Regis. He says annoying. Oh, spectators! I, I was thinking of choice specs. I'm like choice specs. What? That that's not that's not choice specs. Um. So I believe if I get the Lechi boost, I will be able to KO Volibi at this point. Um. I do. He's going Red Ice. I'm gonna go Semi Sage. He goes Metang. That's interesting. I definitely would have thought Red Ice was the play, but I guess. I guess. That also might have just been him predicting me to predict uh, Regis go to Grumpig, pursuit me, but I'm not risking Grumpig like that. Uh, so I do expect his pursuit, and I'm going to knock off as he goes right to Volibi. That was not the play, because now he can now he can heal up. That was not the play. on my That was a bad, bad play on my part. Right to Chew. As he U-turns, he doesn't even... He doesn't even heal his own Volibi. I think that's a little questionable, to be honest. Um... But he does have a full health Gabite to check Driftblim. That's the thing. The like, Gabite is at full health. And uh... oh, okay, he got me there. Um... My weird Gabite set can't touch Volibi, and that's annoying me right now. Like I just opted to not run Dragon Claw, <laughs> Toxic Roar, because I thought it'd be a cool innovation, and um, that's coming back to bite me in the ass. I can just rocks and roar. Uh, and it's right to Reg Ice, the one Mon I did not want him getting in. Uh, he is lefties Reg Ice, because he didn't have Life Orb and he had Grumping. I could go for rocks. I could just straight rocks right here. Because at that point, his Volibi won't be beating shit. But I also I need to take out this Reg Ice. Um, unfortunately, this is a very weird Gabite. It's Toxic Roar, max HP, max speed, which is just, like, the one set that he could really abuse. If I was max attack, this game would already be over. Uh, but I'm running a funky set, and that's just coming back to, like, yes. I'm gonna have to go right to Pig. As he predicts that goes Metang. This is a 50-50 on whether he's gonna pursue it or not, but, um... I think he's gonna meteor mash. That's my that is my call on the 50-50. And if he doesn't, then I at least have Culverberry and I'll be able to take one hit from that red ice. But that red ice is uh, nope, I got it wrong. Okay, could have been worse. That's just thirty percent. Um, God damn it! I hate this Gabite set. Fuck. Any other set would win. Anything else? I'm just clicking rocks. He goes right to Volibi. I'm waiting for a full para. Didn't get a full para into Semipore. That's just not what I wanted. Click Luminion. I see Ice Beam. So I finally have a little bit of momentum here because this is a U-turn. That Gabite set. I'm just so sad right now. That goddamn Gabite set. Alright, let's go to Grumpy. He's a salt fest regice. Or maybe he's like chopple rock polish? I don't know. I'm too uh, shadow ball. Fuck. Um I need to T-wave. As he goes my time. He's likely gonna bullet punch. Uh, he definitely got me. I tried to shadow ball. Ah, oh, I hate this goodbye set right now. I hate it so much. I hate it with a passion. I'm clicking rocks. Okay, he just keeps going Volibi. And I keep not getting full paras. Fuck.
Volva isn't even annoying. The only thing it beats is Gabite, but I need rocks for the Regis. Yeah, no Dragon Claw is fair, though. It's, it's my own bad set coming and killing me. Um... He can just click Ice Beam, I think. I just need to Earthquake to get off the damage. There's nothing I can do about that. Okay. So Simi Sage is going to come on out. And... If I Superpower, he could really just go to Metang. I'm going to knock. Okay, I do catch the Metang. That's nice. that doesn't kill and he does pursuit which is what I thought he was gonna do which is why I stayed in which is why my simi sage is still alive and now um, overgrow seed bomb can come through potentially as he's gonna get his full bite back in I can't really kill this anymore can I hit focus blast please I have to hit a focus blast okay I hit a focus blast if I didn't I would lose uh, but I did, which means I still have a shot. Still have Am shot as he goes to bite. And I need a Scald Burn. That's what I need here. That is a required part of winning. As he's not Scarf, so he's definitely Scarf Semipore. I didn't get a Scald Burn. I have to click Scald again. Can I please get a Burn? I don't agree with him letting me weaken the bite, because now... Yeah, okay. If I had a Scald Burn, I would have won. That's unfortunate. Because, well... I actually don't know how unhealthy you'd have to be for Blunt to win, but I think a Skull Burn would have been enough damage. Um, so I think I can eat up a T-Bolt and click U-Turn. Um, well, that really sucks. Yeah, this game has just been massively unfortunate. Don't use that Gabite set. I, I really should have taken this game. Uh, but that is going to be the final nail in the coffin. I guess what? I go Drift Blim. I can take a hit, can I? He probably T-bolted. So what? I live one hit. He dies to burn. He goes to Gabite. I weaken Gabite. But I die. I have to go some sort. Now I go Luminium. If I'd Scald Burned Gabite so that Driftlim could sub up on it, I would have won. And uh, okay, he goes Gabite again. I need to Scald Burn this fucker. Burn it, please. Burn, burn, burn. Thank you, Luminium. Now I can U turn as he goes for the rocks, but that's a substitute. He's not Roar, he's toxic. Unless he's running the same shitty set I am. Um, I need acro to kill here. As I get a crit and it doesn't kill, and I get a full para, and I won. Awesome. So I finally got the f I just needed one full para to win. <laughs> just one. And I finally get it here. Um, that was all the game took. I definitely feel like I choked that away uh, just by ha purely by having a stupid gabite set was what lost me the game uh, but I needed one if I had full paired him earlier too so that's four chances to get a full para so technically I'm gonna call that not hacks because um, yeah he had to lock himself in the grass not all right that's that's game one that is that is a game that is a game that is the first game what else did I build for I don't remember what I built. I built that. Didn't I? I didn't build anything else. Oh, I remember what team I was going to use. Okay. I have this team built around Source and it's Jump Pluff that I like. It's a rather fun team. I didn't build anything else. I only built two teams. Uh, which sucks. Okay. He brings Theravius, Swalot, Stall. Fuck. Alright, 
the Ravius Fall at Stall, actually, Sleep Powder Sword Stance Jump Off really does put in work. I can't even lie. I am a Lumberry Golem, <laughs> which is actually nice because he has multiple status users. Uh, I have Specs Lapras to put on. Okay, I I'm feeling this matchup. I have Trick Scarf Mime. Trick Scarf Healing Wish No Focus Blast. Oh my god, the counter teams here are just disgusting. Okay, uh, he has Defog Staravia, which only defogs on Longferno. That is the one, well, maybe Scarf Mime, I don't know. But I, I do want Rocks. And if he goes Gorgeist and Wisps, I still have a, I still have a Golem. Alright, he does go Gorgeist. Check out this shit right here. Get fucked. He didn't check the frisk. You always have to check the frisk. <laughs> Lumberry Golem. I don't even know what I was. Th okay, he went right. Just he was just not feeling it. Went right to Sturavia. All right. Let me see how much. And uh, I think this is Jolly. I want to say this is a Jolly Monferno. If I had to guess, yes, it's a Jolly Monferno. Okay, Sturavia, 252, 252. Bold Eviolite versus a Monferno Pew all out attacker not offensive and at minus one I'm doing diddly piss that that's zero that's literally negative zero damage What the hell all right go go in. Set up my rocks. That's all I have to do. What if he's feather dance because then he can beat me one on one That would suck if he was feather. Yeah, because he'd take the hit, he'd be able to roost, get the neutrality. That would be rather unfortunate. Um, okay, he just U turns. I lose my sturdy. That's only really going to come into play versus Gorgeist, I guess. And um, because I'm weakening, weakening Staravia with rocks, I'm fine going right back out to Monferno. As he does foul play. Um, I will U turn. I think that's a safe play. I guess he could stun fist para me, which would make it not a safe play, but... Oh, he stays in. Alright. You got me. He's probably gonna wisp. Uh, synthesis. Okay. He was just gonna stall out Flare Blitz. That's a totally fair play. Um, he's He's gotta switch out at this point, right? Oh, he went... Okay, I was kind of expecting Odno. So that pr tells me that he's Spadef Clefairy and Spadef Odno, which is just a little bit overkill in my opinion, but if you really wanna... If, if that's what you wanna be doing here. If that's what you swanna be doing here. Uh, Rock Blast means that there's no way I'm breaking past Gorgeist. And he is Rock. This mat, this is going rather unfortunately. Right, we double back to Lapras. Nah, just click Rock Blast. Just click Rock Blast. Um. Uh, Jump up needs sign like a good amount of chip to break past this stuff. And I'm not entirely sure where I'm going to get that. Plus, setup fodder is really maybe odd enough if he's not Encore or Toxic. Like, he'd have to be Heal Bell Knockoff, and he's likely Heal Bell Clefairy. Maybe Stun Fist if I get lucky or something. Uh, but this matchup is not looking good for me. Uh, or at least it seemed okay, but I didn't think that he'd be both Spadef Clefairy and Spadef Odno, which means that Lapras just doesn't have any room to break. Like, dual, very bulky spadef things is just unfortunate. Oh, he goes right to Gorgeist. Uh, I get off a little chip. Not a lot of chip, just a little chip. And, uh... Lapras. Because he just straight burns. So, the, I'm, like, I'm getting some chip on this, which is nice. Uh, I feel safe just ice beaming. I think that's the play. He's not staying in. There's no way he can risk Gorgeist. I just want to see the damage here. 
but yeah, that is max for Deathcraft. Fuck me. I have Taunt on Electrode, that could come in handy, I guess. I can go right to Jump Bluff and sleep here. I think that's the play. Um, get jump off game earlier. Sword stance and hope you don't wake up. As a, he goes right to Swalot. That is gonna take the hits. I can't stay in here. As a, he goes for a sludge bomb, he gets a crit, but he doesn't get a poison, which is the important part. He needs Swalot, because at that point it's his best shot at stopping the thing. So he's going right to Gorgeist. So I make the Devil in Inferno. Quick U turn. He's not staying in. Yeah, the stall matchup is uh, rather awkward here. Just because I have close to the right amount of breakers, but he just happens to have, like, the Swallow. The Clif and standard stall, I feel like I have a generally good matchup against here. Um, but he's not running standard stall, he's running funky ass stall that has weird stuff. So I have to go Lapras, which is going to be practically dead. Uh, Clefairy is too low, so if I can just get off some Hydro, some Hydro cheap, uh, this should do a lot. No, I miss. So that, like, that miss gives him any bit of momentum, he could, all the momentum that he could possibly want. Uh, comes right out of that miss. And there's nothing I can do. He just has the momentum here. And uh, this is basically game. I really need to hit that. Uh, I can hope that he's not Encore. Which I think is rather unlikely here. Like, he's probably Encore. Or going right to Swallot, which is a fair play. He went Staravia? Whoa, that's that's not that's not the counter. I mean, maybe it is, but I don't think it is. He's probably okay. I thought he was just gonna defog and take the rock blast since he deeded up. Um, yeah, my first team would have had the perfect matchup against this nasty plot surf Raichu would have just absolutely demolished him here. Um, back to Inferno because he quick wisps. Quick Blitz, even though he's probably just going to Synthesis on it. Yeah, he can Synthesis stall my mom for now. That's Gorgai Super for you. I can, I can click HP Ice here, but we both, like, we both know this game is just over anyway. Uh, Taunt is, like, Cool, but it's just not enough to save me. It's too little at a point in the game where it's just too late. Uh, yeah. Yeah. That's it, it makes for boring commentary, and I apologize for that, but there really is nothing I can do here. So I think I'll just go back to my game one team for game for game three. I liked I liked that team. I think it was fun. He goes to Odno just to like life orb stall me. Oh, he is knockoff. Okay. Okay. So this is this is this is the game right here that is over. I'll I'll just forfeit. Not saying GG because he did not give me a GG for game one. He was mad about the para. Um, challenge game three. I th I, th I liked that first team. I thought it was fun. Let me just change that motherfucking good bite. You don't need roar toxic. That's just me being stupid. I still think max HP, max speed might be cool. I don't really know. Accepts. I'm just gonna bring back game one as he actually built three teams that team is Raichu weak as hell 
Like, is one Starfer, be it this, or this, or this, is gonna take on Raichu. Otherwise, it's just too slow, and slow teams get blown by Raichu. Uh, he does have the Volibi as his one check to blimp again, so hopefully I can Toxic that and not be a total idiot. I think he's gonna lead Rotom, so I'm just gonna toss out Grumpig as he leads Politoed. That's interesting, because, like, if I were him, I'd be predicting a Raichu lead. Not wanting, like, don't get behind the Raichu game, because that's my biggest threat. You don't want to lead something that gets boned by the biggest threat. But I'll go straight to Luminion. Uh, not really predicting anything crazy turn one as he goes to Good Bite. Misses Toxic, which kind of sucked for him. I was willing to get Toxic, like trade Toxic sounded fine to me. Just Scald. His Gabite's already pretty weakened. That is a Drifling check. Um, let me defy. Nope. I got that prediction wrong. <laughs> okay. Okay. Free slow U turn. Unless he's Specs, which I don't think he is. Just looking at that team, he needs Encore to play around some stuff. He actually Ice Beams. Predicting Simi Sage, I suppose. Um, there was not a shot in hell that was actually going Simi Sage there, but fine. I'm just gonna T-Bolt. Not make a prediction. He goes super. As that did not do very much, so I'm questioning whether a plus two HP Ice will do a lot. Uh, I need it to do a lot. He's probably clicking a status here. But the question is, do I want my Raichu to get shipped? And I really don't. I don't have the switch in here. So I think I go to bite. As he seeds, he doesn't wisp. That's good for me. And I click rocks. So now he wisps. And, uh... Click toxic. And, uh, my gabite is very weakened at this point. That's not fun. If I were him, I... He, he is a totally safe wisp right here. So I'm going Luminion. Uh, because... I can't do any damage to him, and I'll die to the residual. So yeah, he clicks Wisp. Uh, now I'm just gonna U-turn. I'm fat. Why am I faster? Oh, I'm at, I'm naturally faster. Fuck me. That's bad. Uh, if he Wisped again, he's an absolute lord. Ah, fuck. He's not Wisping. Fuck. He Wisped. He got me. He got me good. Uh, he's going Volibi, so I can at least knock that off, which is nice. And, uh, go right to Chew and Nasty Plot. Reset, reset that up. Show me your, show me your Poonter. Actually, I could just HP Ice, that's totally free. He's toxic, he's too low to take the two HP Ices. This goes Rotom, I could have predicted that as well, but I didn't. I definitely could have. Um... Volting would be incredibly real. Dundies is a real person. Nope, 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 nope. That was a bad play. Er, I mean, it, it was a wrong predict, but Gabite was still the death fodder, so that's okay. Um, his Volibi cannot take two Focus Blasts. It's too weak. It's too low. But I could just double right back to Chew. Because he goes Gabite? That's interesting. I mean, it's, fair, it's a fair sacrifice, but it's just interesting. So, yeah, I'll just HP Ice. He goes Politoed. I'll just T Bolt. He's not Scarf, I don't think. Is he, I think he's Scarf Rotom. Because he's actually doubling around just to rack up Life Orb, but he's taking all the chip that I want him to. Okay, I, I thought I honestly thought that he was gonna go Rotom, and he was just trying to rack up Life Orb, but he wasn't. He was just sacking the appropriate sack, and you know, getting a bit of safe chip and all that. So I'm definitely feeling Blimp, but I lost my Rocker, and that Volibi is not weakening enough. So I'm gonna go Grumpig. If he volts, I could definitely be in a bad situation. Ah, uh, that's not good. That's not good at all. I have to go Luminion. Like, that's not even a question. I just have to do it. Keep rocks off. As a... 
Defog is the play. He actually Dragon Claws. Gets a crit. That didn't matter because I would have died after Toxic anyway. Um, the problem here is Smash Crustle in the back is looking like it is going to sweep me. Um, that's a rather pessimistic thing to say, but I just think he is going to sweep me with that. And I'm going to go Grunt Pig. If I am real, I'd go right back to Raichu. If I was real, I am. I, like, I have to make that play here. Alright. That put me back in the game somewhat. I mean, not somewhat. It did put me back in the game. That's that's a free kill. Uh, he doesn't need Politoed, but if I, I just have to keep this edge. And he goes Rotom. And now here's the problem, because I really want to predict a Volt Switch. That's just ideal here. Like, predict him to go for a Volt Switch, and everything's cool. But if he Blizzards, and I lose Raichu, I can't break his Volibi. I can't break it. I'm going to change this Grump Pig to Taunt right now, because that way I could, like, Focus Blast and then Taunt it, and he can't recover it all. And, uh, yeah, but I can't. And if I go, like, Simi Sage on the Volt, he smashes and wins. He just has to smash and win. Um, because my play here is basically do so much damage to Crustle that even a burned Simi Sage can revenge it. <sighs> He's gonna break it. No! He got me. Fuck. He got me. Okay. That's basically game. That is, um, for U turn. It's gonna be free setup. Um, there's not much. To, yeah, I think that was the game. I really had. I had to get that prediction right, and I didn't. And that just sucks. Uh, I would like to go Simi Sage, but I can't because he can just U-turn into Cross Little Smash and Win. Uh, so I guess I have to go Blink. Because at the very least, I can knock the Cross Little, then sucker the Cross Little, or he goes right to Burn and Frost. That's fair as well. Uh, he doesn't have a reason not to blizzard. Maybe I sack Simi Sage go Grand Pig. Because if I can do enough, I have to. I'd have to keep this for sucker though. Um, or I could sub and hope for a miss. Okay. Okay. Go Grand Pig. Focus Blast two K is fall by at this point. But that requires hidden. Or he or I could double the Raichu. But he could just go right to Rotom. He might Blizzard predicting that as well. He doesn't. I need to hit two focus blasts. Like that's my win con here, hidden two, which is just not in my favor. Yeah, of course it isn't, so. Yeah, if I had hit two I would have been fine, but now I'm in range of the thing in the jigger. I'm in range of Blizzard, so. Or he just debolts. He he ain't even he ain't even afraid. Um, what am I? Twelve thirty six. I'm pretty fast. Rotom Frost, Scarf, Drifblim, Pew Acroblim. I can live with T-Bolt. It's in my favor to live at T-Bolt. If I go to Raichu, all he has to do is sack Volibi, go into Rotom, click Blizzard, and win. That's a fact. I have I have to go win. Now, if I sub on Volibi, then I can take it out with an Acro. But I think he's going to T-Bolt. No, okay, and I don't, and I don't get the roll. Um, that's just all kinds of unfortunate. That's just all kinds of unfortunate business. Um, I really wish there was something I could do there, but missing a Focus Blast and not getting the roll, there's nothing I can do. So I hope you guys enjoyed some Battle of the Week. These were still decent games. Um, uh, I really think I could have had that game if I just hit the Focus Blast. That would have been my game. 
uh, so yeah that's it I, ho I hope you enjoyed <laughs>